It's closing day at Hialeah, and the Flamingos put on their show for the Miami crowd on hand for the Flamingo Stakes. I'm Dennis Testa, and I'm the love doctor. In 1931, Mr. Widener brought in a dozen birds from Cuba, and the ones here today are the direct descendants of those same birds. They started breeding in 1934, and the first eggs that we had seen here at the park was in 1936. I came to Hialeah Park when I was seven years old in 1958. Uh, the original owner of the park, Mr. Morey, brought my dad down to be the general superintendent. We had an issue in 1983, about 10 years went by. We didn't have any breeding, we didn't have any eggs, didn't have any babies. And that's when my dad and I started thinking about what, what could we do, something had to be done. So one evening, my dad and I got some leg stockings from my wife, filled it with plaster of Paris because that's about the same size as a flamingo egg. And that evening, I went out on the island, put a half a dozen eggs out. And a couple of weeks later, we noticed that the birds had started laying eggs. With the history, and they said, you know, if it worked before, it'll probably work again, did the same thing. Little rain, little mud mounds, plastic eggs, and so I'm expecting we're going to be between 80 and 90 hatchings this year, which is absolutely fantastic. The flamingos will always have a place at Hialeah Park, now and forever. <laughs>